Hi, I'm Dr. Mike Milligan. I'm here with Jameson Spencer of Silent Sleep. Jameson, thanks so much for being with us. My pleasure. My pleasure. Now, you're out of Boise, Idaho, Boise, so that's got to yes. be a good thing. That is. Absolutely. And uh, uh, tell us a little bit about Silent Sleep, how long you've been around, what it does for us. Yeah, so Silent Sleep I invented about four or five years ago. Uh -huh. uh, it is a temporary or trial or intermediate appliance for sleep apnea, right. for snoring. It may also be used for bruxism. bruxism exactly. Yeah. In the last few years, research has shown that bruxism, in spite of what we were taught in dental school and in other areas, uh, being due to emotional stress, right. occlusal patterns, things like that, is more likely the result of people trying to not die. Exactly. So they're get clenching their teeth. at night. Exactly. They clench, it wakes them up. Absolutely. And so now they get oxygen. You, you can live with a lot, a lot of, live without a lot of things, but you can't live without oxygen. That's right. Uh, so, an, okay. Enamel wear is really low down on the priority list right. for your brain. It really wants air. Yeah. So the silent sleep can be used in those cases for a general dentist, but uh, the idea behind this would be that we as dentists are excellent first line practitioners, healthcare providers for screening patients, right. referring them to the sleep lab, to the sleep physician right. for evaluation and then ultimate treatment, which may be CPAP, it may be an oral appliance. It might be surgery, might be surgery. might be to a dentist for oral appliance, either Correct. yourself or one of your colleagues. That's right, who, absolutely. Who is, uh, treat, treating the uh, sleep apnea. Yes, exactly. Okay, so so tell us a little bit more about your appliance here. Uh, it's pretty, it's very, it's kind of an interim thing. Yeah. Uh, uh, in, in other words, you, you can make this in about 10 minutes. Yes. Cost of the dentist is about $65. Yeah, so the cost of the dentist overall is about 65 bucks. Most dentists, the way they charge for this is they charge the same price as they would for a night guard. Right. Uh, it starts off as this here. Yep. Uh, so this, and then it's filled with this pink material, which many will recognize as GC reline material. Right. We squirt that in here and then the patient closes. We use an anterior jig to find the right anterior posterior position. Okay. Yep. And then the nice thing too is we can rip this material out uh -huh. and reline it as many times as necessary. Exactly. So we can do multiple different positions. Right. Uh, exactly. Another thing that we'll do with this for people that are doing more in dental sleep medicine is let's say you have a patient and you're just not sure if an oral appliance is gonna be effective or not. We can make three of these. Right. Three different positions. Right. Get them back to the sleep lab, okay. try the positions, and figure out which one is most effective. Right. Then After that, up. exactly, use this basically as our bite registration right. for a custom oral appliance. Okay. So we can use this in a number of ways. Yeah. We can use it to treat bruxism. Yes. We can use it uh, then also as an interim appliance to see if they have sleep apnea and even. Uh, uh, help us to, to, to titrate as to where they ought to be built in a custom appliance. Yes. Um, say after uh, three months wear or so of one of these, um, then you can give the, see if it helped their sleep apnea or their snoring, give the patient the option then of making another one. Exactly. Or going to a custom appliance. Absolutely. Well, some, some of my patients, this is all they can afford. Uh, maybe they don't have, maybe, maybe they don't have sleep apnea. They've been to the sleep lab. Right don't have sleep apnea, but they still snore. Exactly. So a lot of patients that go to the sleep lab, they go there because they're snoring and their wife won't sleep with them anymore or whatever. Oh, you bet. And the doctor comes back and says, hey, Mike, good news, you don't have sleep apnea. And you're like, well, yeah, so I what? my wife to sleep with me again. Yeah, still, yeah. still snoring. So you could fit this, which is a lower cost alternative than a custom right. appliance, and reline it every six months to a year. Right. Now, I, frankly, I have patients that have worn this for two years. Okay without being relined. Okay. So it will last a long time, yeah. but as dentists, Depends we see our patients things. regularly anyway. You get them in and you reline them. Okay, super. Anything else you'd like to tell us about Silent Sleep? So Silent Sleep, uh, again, uh, in my practice, my practice is limited to TMD and sleep. Okay. Major connection between jaw right. problems, TMJ problems, and sleep apnea. Right. So we find that this is also an excellent appliance to use in the patient who is having jaw problems, where we think it may be related to airway issues. Right. So again, as a for general dentists out there, uh, I think using this as a bruxism tool to not just, right now, dentists treat bruxism by putting a piece of plastic on the teeth to protect the teeth. Right. That would be similar 
to if my patient's problem was hitting their head against the wall, yeah. giving them a helmet. <laughs> let's fix the real problem. Let's here. fix the real problem. Let's, <laughs> let's figure out what's going on and then treat it. Okay, fantastic. How do we get in touch with you? Uh, so I'm in Boise, Idaho. Uh, my phone number okay. is 208 Eight six one five six eight seven. That's actually my cell phone number. Okay. My yeah. office number two zero eight three seven six thirty six hundred. Otherwise, uh, website, you got your website is www.cti as in Cadwell Therapeutics Incorporated. Okay. CTI Sleep. Com. Okay. On that website, there's videos of me fitting the appliance, okay. uh, how it's done, videos of other custom appliances that we, we don't sell, but again, we look at this as a transition right. to long-term care. So okay. on that site is a lot of educational materials. Fantastic. Yeah. Spencer, thanks yeah. so much for being with us. My pleasure. Okay. Thanks, Mike.